Welcome back to Space Engineers and Monkey B. And it's time for space. Three, two, well, not yet. Still got a few jobs to do. But we will be in space before the end of this episode. Between episodes, I chucked in some air vents, some additional ramps, changed up this uh, section here so it um, looks a little bit better. I've um, put an air vent in here. Uh, if anyone has no better idea than using the grates, uh, sorry, the walkways, uh, give me a suggestion. The um, I tried using the there were like window vents or something, and they didn't really work too well as far as I was concerned. One stage, at some stage in the future, I'll start with some automation for controlling the doors. But like I said earlier, the uh, inner doors will be all left open when I go into space. Uh, maybe. No, probably not a good idea. Anyway, let's have a look what we've got. I need some resources. During the between episodes, I went out and got a ton of ice. You know, got uh, one point. 3 million there. Uh, I need iron, magnesium and uranium. I've got a ton of silver when I went out um, and I got a ton of gold as well. So and my ingots itself I've got pretty much everything I need there. Platinum of course I need to get but I can't do that when I get till I get in space and I'm pretty good with all my components as far as Tim's uh, concerned. No, thruster components, but uh, time will get me to that stage. So, I'm going to go and do a little bit more mining, and, uh, and then I'm going to do a little bit of cleanup, put some things away, put the... I go back on its uh, landing pad, and then... Um, oh, I also want to remove the solar panel off the monument, because it was never meant to be that. Uh, what else? I think... I got the two drives, got both jump drives in, a few more piping. I put an oxygen uh, tank in there. So I've got oxygen now, got room to put an additional one. I was going to put some lighting in here, but uh, some weird effect with lighting and the possibly to do with the blast door blocks where the light just doesn't seem to want to be there when you're there. Also I used uh, some uh, walkways to cover up these windows as the uh, one by one uh, half windows don't actually work. So I am going to go and do some mining. Uh, I also chucked in some lighting so you can see I've got my lights off and going down the corridor I've got lights all over the place now and lights down uh, down here as well as I chucked a light in here on both sides close door No cursor makes it really hard. Alrighty. Also moved my air vent to chuck a light up there. But uh, it's only just to put oxygen in, so it doesn't matter. I uh, don't know if there's going to be enough uh, gyros, but we'll see. I've got the uh, generator, the um, gravity gen down there. I think I have everything I need to get into space, but... Uh, whoops, didn't mean to do that. But time will tell. So, between now and a few minutes time, I'm going to go and do a little bit more mining. Alright, back in a few minutes. Okay, I just got back from doing some mining, got some magnesium, got some uranium. Decided not to worry about uh, 
any more of anything else. And I'll handle that when I get into space. But I do want to get rid of this. Because it's not meant to be there. And I've got a battery that's in the off position, so it's not going to be using any power. And I'm also going to check my resources here. Might want to make door. Woohoo! I haven't used that thing in yonks. Yeah, let's just have a quick look. Okay, just some tools. I will take a gun. Ammunition. Take that ammunition. Don't need nothing else. What else? I'll leave that bit of ice. That's pretty much it. I do want to put the Argo back up, so let's do that. I love this ship. It's so cool. So fast. Ooh, almost crashed. Jeez, it spins on a dime. go. Let's lock that in. Okay, that's back where it needs to be. Just putting things away, just like to have it ready, connected, it can be kept charged by the solar panels. Um, in fact, I'm going to switch them on to recharge. Let me just get that in. I go battery, 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 three batteries. All set to recharge. Alrighty, so that way that will just stay charged and not be used up. Now I don't think there's anything being refined. Oh there is some stuff, I'll pull that out. Nothing in the assembler one. I got some stuff I'll pull out of assembler two. Uh, must be some jobs. Assembler three. Cool. Nothing else. Nothing. Okay. There's an audio bug here. If you listen, you can it sounds like the motors are still running, even though they're not. Actually they are. <laughs> I could have sworn I switched them off. And But still, audio bug. Sounds like they're still running, but they're not. So after the... Not the 8.1 update, but the one before it. That uh, came in. Alrighty. Well, it is time to shut up and take off. As you can understand, I'm going to save. Because when this comes crashing down, as it will... I don't want to have to start from this beginning. Alrighty. This is scary shit. Scary as hell. Alrighty. I think I've got everything. I've got my... Uh, I've got, I've got oxygen, I've got jump drive, I've got all the bits and pieces, I've got hydrogen, I've got ice, I've got, um, they're all closed down there, I've got um, uranium, 
I've got uh, full t ten full tanks of uh, ten full tanks of ox uh, of hydrogen. One full tank of oxygen. They closed. Let's close this one. Going to go to that refinery on Lara base, grab everything out of it. It's off. Everything else should be on Drake. Alrighty, let's go upstairs. And let's get ready. I'll be back in a few moments when I'm uh, all ready to actually take off. The day has come. We are. Uh, Ready for launch. This is scary as bloody hell. I've set up some icons. So let's see. I'm just going to start with the etheric. I just want to do a quick run around and just verify that they're all all on. Oof. Scary. You don't believe how uh, how much I'm shaking currently, thinking about you know what will happen if this comes crashing down. I have two backups, so you know I'm feeling good. Okay, that one's not on. That one's not on. And those two ain't on. I must not have updated the group. Alright, back in two secs. Okay, we are ready to go. I'm just going to pull back. <sighs> I hope this all works. Thrusters are on. I'm just going to start by seeing. Atmospherics are not powerful enough. Alright, it looks like hydrogen. Oh no! Oh no, 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 no. Why are we twisted? I haven't the faintest. We're on our way up. We're not going to make it. <laughs> I can already see the. Uh, Hydrogen going down at a rate that is way more than than we have. And for some reason, ah, uh, side movement must have been. Put that nose perfectly level. Oh, this is hair raising. Will we make it? My uh, prediction is no. We're only at 4,000. Used 10% of our hydrogen. We're making uh, hydrogen as we take off, but... Uh, at the moment, I don't think we're producing enough. We may have to rethink this whole thing. We're 75 meters, so 75, 7,500, 8,000. We're moving pretty slow. The uh, hydrogen should be starting to become more efficient. We're getting closer and closer to the uh, zero gravity. We may make it. 
we have left the planet behind. We're eighty percent hydrogen used. We did have about three hundred kilos of uh, ice in reserve, so that should be helping. The sounds are starting to change. Sound is changing. Sound is changing. It's like we must be getting into view of the sun. It should. My landing gear is still there. There you are. Let's uh, see what happens. Let's retract our front landing gear. That doesn't seem to be working. Let's. None of our landing gears seem to be working. Worry about that uh, if we make it. Atmosphere. We're uh, almost out. Uh, I think there might be rotor lock or something, so they might not be working because of that. I think over 60 kilometers an hour, the the uh, 60 kilometers, whatever it is, 60 meters per second. The rotors and pistons lock, I think, automatically. Looks like I might have lost a uh, thruster. Yes, I did. I lost a thruster on takeoff. Wow. Hydrogen thrusters are pretty damn badass. Alright, we've still got 1.8 of gravity. I'm going to just keep that going full blast until we get up. So that 50% of our hydrogen is used, and we're not quite into space yet. 30,000 meters. Let's have a quick look around while we're uh, going up. Oh, there's an asteroid. Another one behind us. Let's have a look at the planet below. <laughs> Looking good. Looking good. Clear enough, we won't hit any of those asteroids. Near orbit. I'll be staying clear of all them. I don't want to be entering back into atmosphere. Not anytime soon. We're 68. We're getting there. Thirty-eight thousand point five of a G. Let's see how we go. Don't think I need to use any more thrusters. Oh, looks like my uh, landing gears all just went up. Why I turned so rapidly just then, I haven't found this, but uh, we we made it. We're in space. I need to turn on those guys. They'll slowly slow us down. Looks like we're coming close to an asteroid, too. Several of them. Boy, 
Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, Drake is officially a spaceship. I'm going to uh, I'm going to roll us and use the big thrusters to slow us down. I don't know what that weird audio sound is. It's like little tiny meteorites hitting the ship. Looks like that front landing gear did pop off. A little bit of damage on the undercarriage there. That thruster. signals and our velocity is pretty slow we're still moving but I'm just gonna go and check on my thrusters Like some didn't turn on. That is one strange audio bug, I tell you that. Alrighty. We are coming to a stop. Let's find ourselves what is the nearest asteroid. Oh, there's the moon! Okay. Definitely don't have enough uh, rotors. Quite a slow process of turning the ship. Gyros, I should say. Alrighty, I'm going to save where we are and uh, I'm going to quit and see if I can get rid of that audio. So I'll be back shortly. Alrighty, I'm back. The audio bug is gone. So I might just go for a bit of an EVA and explore the ship. We're pretty safe here. Got an asteroid in front of us. I've got artificial gravity. Atmosphere is good. Now I need to go downstairs. Let's put these on so I can see. It should be good. We are. Oh. Booger. Something I'd done before. I had a computer crash today. Lost, uh, lost the save point. Um, and I had a small cargo container here with uh, tools and stuff in it. I've seem to have lost them but uh, luckily the items are actually in my inventory which was the hydrogen bottle and the oxygen bottles so I'm gonna go and survey the damage as the ship is not moving we are good where to put a helmet on Pretty. 
Okay, how much damage here? Not a lot. I'm going to do some repairs and uh, I'll be back after I've done that. Well, we have come to the end of the episode. We are in space. There's the planet below. Absolutely beautiful. And here is the ship. I've uh, fixed up the thruster on this side. I worked out what happened. The connector, the magnetic section of the connector had uh, was still connected. I should have put in a piston to pull that out of the way, but never mind. I survived and made it up. I've uh, repaired the blocks under here, so that's all working again. Still got to put a piston, a landing gear back here and replace the broken bit of piston. So that was because when I was playing around earlier, I forgot to reset the top level. So when it went up, it pulled itself all the way in. This is so cool flying around in space. I can walk on the ship. We are good. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I am so happy. This is Monkey B. I'd like to thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, share. And uh, next episode, we'll be off to do some mining and build a new mining ship. I'm looking forward to that, I can tell you. The, the excitement of uh, building a new ship, of a new design. I got a great idea in my head, which is going to be really cool. It, uh, and you're going to really like it, so uh, keep on watching. It's, uh, it's nice to be in space. The world is shining brightly. All right, then. This is Monkey B. You have a good one. Later.